So today I wanted to do an elf haul and I just ordered and it came in this huge box. Just like a plain white box with like nothing on it. So you open it up and it's a bunch of paper. And then like the paper the information on it. Okay, and then most of it came in this big deck. So, I ordered 20 items, and it was $30, and I got free shipping. Okay, so we're going to work with, like, the normal line first. Alright, so I got a Shimmering Facial Whip and Pink Lemonade, and I've heard these are really watery. As you see, I haven't opened mine yet. I hope it's not really watery. Um... watery actually like, it's kind of tiny okay well that's what it looks like and ooh, it's really pigmented it's really pink definitely don't need to put that much on my cheeks oh it's really pink hmm. okay all right next product I got two of these, and these are the Super Shiny Lip Shine with SPF 15, which is really nice because you really want SPF on your lips. And I'm just really into these squeezy tubes during summer. I don't know why. I just really like squeezy tubes in the summer. Alright, so this one is in Honeydew, and it's kind of an orangish, orangish, orange, orange, how did you say that? I don't know how to, orangey, I, I don't know. So, it looks like that. It's kind of have an orange tint to it. We'll just say that. And then this next one is Juiced Berry. It has more of a pinky red. Okay. I will pull it. And those are both a dollar. I'm showing you dollar things first. If I already said this. And then I got a e.l.f. Natural Radiant Blusher. And it just looks like this. And this is in the color... Where is it? Right there. Blushed. I mean, yes, blushed. I've heard bad things about their dollar blush, so I wanted to try one to really see if they were good or not. I might have to do a review for you guys. The next thing I got was the e.l.f. Natural Lash Kit. I've heard really good things about their lashes. And it just looks like that. They're in black. And it comes with a little glue, too. I don't know about the glue. I have my own glue that I'll probably use. But for a dollar. Okay, and so I got a cream eyeshadow and a powder eyeshadow. This one's the cream, and this one's just powder. This one is in blueberry, and this one is in butter pecan. Isn't that pretty? I'm really excited to use those. Okay. Next, I got the eyelid primer, just the dollar one. And I've heard really, really great things about these, but I've also heard there's like not a lot of product in the tube. But I've heard really great things. So, I'm going to have to see about that. Okay, next I got a mascara. And this is the Lengthening and Defining Mascara in Black Brown. And I don't really have a brown mascara. As you see, it's kind of a thin tube. It looks like eyeliner. So it's probably going to run out really fast. But I don't know if I like brown mascara. And I got the Tone Correcting Concealer in the color Light Beige. Little. Mm. I'm really picky about concealer, so we're going to see about that. Um, I also got the Liquid Eyeshadow, and this is the color Sultry Satin. And I guess it's just like a cream liquid eyeshadow. I don't know how I feel about that yet. Um, I got... The concealer brush. I had a lot of people like this as a lip brush, and I really needed the lip brush, so I got it. And then I got two of these e.l.f. shimmer pencils. I got one in Iconic Ivory and Grassy Green. And like they have like little sharpeners, like the lids are sharpeners. How cool is that? I think it's really cool. 
Okay. And that is all of my $1 stuff. And I got a quite a lot of $1 things. I just kind of wanted to try out their $1 line. Because no one really talks about it so much. They mostly just talk about the studio line. Okay. So now going on to the studio line. Um, I got the Eye Transformer kit, I guess. And at the, on the website, they looked like they were like cream eye like shadows. I like kind of like a cream concealer palette, and they're not; they're powder. So I don't know. I'm not sure I feel. What does it look like? And it comes with a little brush. This is the only thing I've actually opened before the video because I was kind of upset. But like, there's the yellow. It doesn't really look yellow. I don't know. I'm kind of disappointed in that. Okay, and then I got two blushes. If I could pull them both out of the bag, it'd be nice. And I got one in Candid Coral. Because I need a nice coral blush for summer. And then I got one in Pink Passion. And look how pretty that pink is. Okay, so let me show you. If I can get them out of the bag, I'll show you guys. Out of the bag, out of the box. Okay, so this is what it looks like. As you see, it's kind of small. I mean, that's fine. Okay, so this is Candid Coral. So pretty. The color might not show up very well. I'm filming this on my iPad because my camera's not working. And I'm like tearing these boxes up, like trying to get into it. This is really difficult. Okay. And then this is Pink Passion, which I know Sarah Bell 993 or X93 or something like that. She really likes it. Oh my gosh, look how hot pink that is. So pretty. It looks like my NARS blush in hot pink. That one's a pink blush. Okay, and then the last things I got was the Elf Tinted Moisturizer. This is the $3 Tinted Moisturizer. And I got it mine in the color beige. Now it might be too dark. I don't know. It looks kind of dark now. And then I got the stippling brush. Which looks like this. If I can get it out. And it's, I don't know. I kind of don't like it already. Like, look at it. It's just like, it's not dense at all. I'm like, I don't know. I don't think it's going to work for a foundation. Hmm. Okay, and then the last thing I got was the makeup removing cleansing cloths. I know. They were three dollars too. And they look like this. And they are Elf makeup removing cleansing cloths. Gently and easily cleans skin to remove all traces of makeup, dirt, even waterproof mascara. Great for on the go traveling. Okay, so that's my Elf haul. My hair is going crazy. Oh, it's so pretty. Um, let me know if you guys want any reviews on anything. Um, I might do a review on just like the normal line and then a review on the studio line. Because I have previously ordered some e.l.f. products but I never did a review on them. So just let me guys know what you want and thanks for watching. Please subscribe.